Hello everybody and welcome back to another video and today I will be talking about NYX or NYX Prime either or doesn't matter and why this is DE's cheat code for the game but before we get into that I just have to get something out of the air okay if you don't like my builds you can just press the thumbs down button okay you don't have to leave nasty comments Saying the build is weak or it doesn't work because I try to show proof that it does work, okay? But if it doesn't work for you, then that's your problem, buddy, okay? Omni King, mm -hmm. you hear that, buddy? It's your problem, bud. So, if I see another one of those and you're trying to bait me into saying some dumb shit, you will be banned from the channel. That's it. I'm old, man. I don't got time for that shit. But anyways, let's just get on with the video. So, today I'll be showing you why this can make farming liches and sisters a breeze. And the ability that we're going to be talking about is this one. This right here is broken. So, basically, you strip away their defenses, their shields, their armor, down to their normal health bar. It doesn't matter if it's a Lich, it doesn't matter if it's a sister of Parvos, you completely make enemies naked, and it's amazing. And then, on top of that, let's show you the build real quick. I have Energy Siphon, Flow, Assimilate, this is the game changer. So, you can use your alt, and instead of staying still, you can be walking like the Terminator. And letting people know you mean business by casting this. They're minded for the ability duration, streamline, prime continuity, adaptation, intensify, and then fleeting expertise. And of course, the goats, arcane energize, and arcane guardian. Alright, so I will show you guys. And to show you, I will be bringing in a shitty weapon. The Bratton. So, let's go. Oh yeah, I changed my um, my hate's name to the Edge of Death. I just thought it sounded cool. Alright. We're already on Steel Path. Now, the way you're going to notice it is... A lot of the enemies... So, Corpus enemies on Steel Path have more shields. Like, a lot more shields. And then the Grenier they all become elites, so they'll have the yellow bar. So you'll see the yellow bar just disappear. Also, like, Nyx Prime is not one of the best looking primes, but she, she packs some serious power, and I'll show you. These are worthy foes. We're gonna get Under some energy real quick, fill up the bar, Baron. and I'll show you. You can literally just walk around like the Terminator. So let's find some enemies. I'll activate the ult and then I'll cast it too. Here we are. So look. It doesn't matter. Yep, they can shoot me all day. And then watch. Down to red. Mind you, this is a Bratton. See that person's affected down there? Boom. That one's still affected. That one's affected. But look, I'm just walking like the Terminator. Those uh, Butcher guys are pretty easy, even on Steel Path. And I'm using a Bratton, bro. But you see, like, that guy? You see how... It still took a while to kill him? Actually, I gotta show this Bratton build, bro. This shit's actually nasty. But, you know, people don't think my builds work, so, you know, what do I know? But, see? I still have a lot of energy. Obviously, you're not going to walk around the whole map like this. But, I'm just showing that you can just go around and... Look at that, boom. Dead. And there are some Nyx users that already know what I'm talking about. <laughs> about the two being the GOAT. If I had a lich right now, I would have showed you, and it's it's literally broken. There is some videos of people show, showing Nyx doing that to like to liches. The, 
cool. So when I was farming like the Sisters of Parvos and getting like, um, I still need to get a couple weapons, but you, you're damn right I'm gonna be using Nyx for this build. Boom, dead. This is a Breton. One of the worst guns in the game, so this is the Vandal. Which, I like the Vandal a little bit more, because it has a little bit more power. Not that much power, don't get, don't get it twisted. But, yeah dude, look. It's amazing. And I died. Nyx is really squishy. That's why this is kind of good too, but I was letting the energy run out a little bit. Oh, and a Bombarder should give me too, so. But look, Bombards usually have a lot of health. Man, yo, this Brandon build, bro. Hold, hey, wait a minute. <laughs> I, I'll have to talk about that. Hold on a second. We're on to something, boys. Okay, we're on to something. <laughs> All right. You get the picture, so that's Corpus. I mean, wow, that's Grenier. So let's test it out on the Corpus, right? I think that's a better way to show like builds now is how it works with like the two main factions. Because I'm not going to show Infested because Infested are easy at any level because they don't gain armor, they don't gain shields, they still have their normal health bar, so it's stupid. The only thing you have to watch out for on Steel Path with the Infested is the drones because they'll throw the toxic clouds and DE doesn't know how to calculate like multipliers, so you will get insta-killed. It doesn't matter what you have, you could be God, you'll still die. Alright, so let's just do the exterminate. Dude, I did not know the... Oof. The Bratton was... It was hitting. <laughs> Oh man, wait a minute. Your enemies have grown fierce. Use all the I'll have learned. to do some more testing, but I had a ribbon for this thing and I could not get a good roll for the life of me and I was testing out so much stuff. I also added I, I also just got the uh, primary merciless on it too, so I don't know if that's helping it, but Yeah, these guys are gonna take a little bit more effort because I mean, shit. Wow. Wait a minute. Yo, Primary Merciless makes this thing into a god. I'm sorry, I'm just blown away a little bit. Alright. So, look at The shields are gone. Shields are gone. You see where I'm going with this? It makes liches and sisters a joke. Like the like the mechanical dogs that the sisters have, they are a pain in the ass. I don't care what build you have. They take forever to take down. But you hit it with a two, you kill them in like two seconds, bro. Dude. I just put on primary merciless too. I'm not even joking. What the hell? <laughs> Yo, the Breton's hitting. <laughs> I might start using the Breton more now. <laughs> Alright, so just just to clear the air, like, the guy that was complaining about Mazerfield was like, oh, that's a crit weapon. Um, wrong. So Kuva weapons, you can do both builds. They're, they're malleable. You can either do a hybrid build of crit and status, or you can do a full status, or you can do a full crit build. The Kuva weapons are just that amazing. Now, example here. See, like, 16, right? So you th let me add 200 crit chance. 48. That's, that's garbage. That's not going to do anything. But, if I make it into a feeding status weapon, because now I up the rate of fire to almost 14. Wait, yeah, 14. And then... I got the status mods that I like with hammer shot, which adds more status. And then also galvanize aptitude, which plus 40 damage per status type affecting the target for 20 seconds, stacks up to two times. Plus multi shot, which 30% multi shot for 20 seconds, stacks up to five times. So 
This thing's shooting out a shit ton of bullets, causing multiple status, and it, the status grows when it gets more kills. On top of that, on kill, 30% damage for 4 seconds, stacks up to 12 times, 30% reload, 100% maximum, but you know, I don't know builds, so to each their own. But, dude, this thing hits. <laughs> it's funny. I'm going to just start bringing this on missions. People are going to be like, what is he using? i got to change the name of that. That's that's hilarious. All right, um, let's do something like this. Arena, Grenier, level one eighty-five. Bro, <laughs> I did not expect the Brat and Vandal to to hit like that. All right, reduced ability duration. Yikes! All right, I just need to get a kill. But I need energy because the the main thing is showing off the um, the armor stripping ability. Here's one of the energy spawns. Come on, arcane energize. No, not today. All right, all right. Let's see if we get one. All right, this guy takes a little bit more, but look, still take it off. He gains his shields back really quick. Ah, uh, for this I just use like I use Wukong. Actually, no, I think I cheated on this. I used like uh, Limbo. I got a couple kills, and then I just went into the uh, the void just to avoid damage and just let the timer run out. Okay. Well, the brand's not doing that well for like high level, so like 185 plus. Really? This bitch went invisible? Really? There we go, Arcane Energize, thank you. Yeah, they get their shields back quick, because it's the arena, but... It's, uh, Ryan G, I'm using the- I'm using the Bratton. Alright, let's see... Let's build up some status, rip his armor off, and look, wrecked. Of course if I use the hate, I'll, I should wreck them with the hate, so let's try the hate. Oh, yeah, he died. <laughs> Alright, I think you guys get the picture. think you guys get the picture but if you want an easy time with liches and the sisters of parvos this is your girl she is a beast um you you definitely want to get this so that way you can move around while you have your ultimate so that you feel like the terminator just absorbing damage and then you're going to be spamming this the two and then with the build I have, it costs nothing to cast, so you can have this rolling on as long as you want, and then cast that. It's pretty simple build, to be honest. If you don't have prime continuity, you can use regular continuity, so I mean, it's, it is what it is. But this right here, this is, this is it. <laughs> His, I wish this was the the ability you can helmet because oh man but then nobody would use nyx so but this is the ability you helmet but imagine Woo! but that's it hopefully you enjoyed and hopefully this makes your lich and sisters of parva something a lot easier anyways thank you guys for watching and i will see you guys in the next video take care